Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Keep coming. There you go. Go ahead. Yeah. 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 Feeling great, feeling overly excited. I can't imagine to bake every time the long road. I just want to thank all y'all for coming here and supporting me. It's been a long time, man. I feel good right here. I got everybody's important to me right here. They all helped, they all fought the whole long road with me. I ain't just a face of somebody that made it out. I'm the face of many people who didn't make it out. Like, there's a lot more in there. We got to keep fighting for all of them. I can see. I'm continuing to fight for them for sure. What do you want to say to your family who was fighting for you for years? We did it. We did it. I love y'all. We all here together. Did you ever think you would get to this point today? Yes, every day. Thought about it every day. Not one day in there, I thought I wasn't gonna get out. I knew I was coming home. So, what are you most looking forward to? Just taking my kids to Disneyland for the year over man. We're going to see the Browns game. We're going to see the Browns game playing person. All those good days. Enjoy life. Be with my family every day. Enjoy your family. Tell me what you're thinking about the work at the end of this project and helping you get to this point. Amazing job. Amazing job. Amazing job. Kimberly, Kimberly, Kimberly. 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 Kimberly, they stuck through it the whole time and never gave up on me. Like, first time I met all of them, they came and told me they knew I was innocent, they was gonna fight to the finish. Here we is right now at the finish line. What kept you positive and what kept you going in the last 15 years? My family. My family, they held it down, they supported me through all this. Never gave up on me. Always came to see me, made sure I had contact, they was there for me. My family did it. Can you describe um, how the conditions were for you while you were locked away for a crime you didn't commit? It was hectic, it was hard, it was very hard, like, it was very difficult sometimes, like, but I just prayed, I prayed every night, believed in God, had faith in God, I knew he could come and see me through. I just left SOCF, Lucasville, like, very bad prison, like, very bad there, like, but I stayed, God kept me safe, you know what I'm saying, it's it a lot going on there, and he looked into Lucasville. What's your message to people who are in your shoes still right now? Don't give up the fight. Pray every night and let your family know you need help. Like, just don't give up. Don't never give up. That's what, that's what I can get while you're in prison. Do not give up. It's always a fight. Continue on. Don't give up. Never you give up. Do think it's sunk in yet that you're free? Not just now it did, right now. And I seen all these people, I couldn't believe. I've been waiting for like four hours, so you see all y'all still here waiting for me. I feel good. I feel thank good. You. All right, thank you. Thank y'all. Thank, thank all y'all for coming. Real time. Thank you. Yeah, she got off. Yeah, we